happy new year guys <laughs> welcome back to my channel oh my god i have totally lost my voice from talking a lot but guys welcome back <clears throat> as you still know i'm still in dubai i'm so sorry i'm just gonna try to speak as loud as i can but i hope you guys could um can hear me properly i'm so sorry this sounds really weird anyway so um, it's the number maybe 10 in Dubai and I have maybe five days left before I head back to <laughs> you know where so <clears throat> I'm just gonna go for quick breakfast and I'm gonna also do the second part of this video by the pool um, in this video we'll be talking about reasons why I dislike Dubai let's put it that way and the reasons that you could also consider if you are probably an African like me and um, yeah these reasons made me also I mean part of the reason why I decided to leave Dubai so guys <laughs> again I am just gonna go quickly to breakfast but I mean I think I should really start so I mean uh, Dubai Dubai is just such a nice place, you know, it's just such a wonderful place that, you know, it's it's not so easy, especially when you move here as a visitor, it's not so easy for you to really see or to know um, the background of Dubai. <coughs> so, of course, living here is quite different from visiting here because you just get to go and then uh, go to the nice places, see the nice and necessary things you have to see. But then living here will be like a totally different ball game. Anyway, um, before I start rambling left and right, <laughs> the first reason why I didn't see Dubai as a long-term um, home would be the fact that um, the first, first, first reason is the fact that. I couldn't really bear the hot hot weather in the summertime and guys I'm talking about seven months of heat that could literally make you go crazy um, that was for me like a very hard very very difficult um, times because it was just so humid and especially when you don't drive here it's so hard going just you know going from your home to the train station grabbing the train um, that would be like so difficult in the mornings in the evenings and that would literally make you feel like you know like you're dead at the end of the day <laughs> um, so that would be like the biggest reasons re reason number one reason why I didn't see Dubai as a long-term um, home um, number two is the fact that <clears throat> Being an African, being a Nigerian, I mean, typically you want to move to a country where um, you want to live there, you want it to be like your home, um, but also you want to have kids who will probably be nationals of this country, who probably um, reap the benefits of you living and working here for so many years. And I think that's one thing that Dubai has really closed off from the from the rest of the world because as long as you're not married to someone from the Emirates, as long as you're not um, married to a local, let's say the Arab Emirati, you stand no chance of having a citizenship. It doesn't matter if you were born here. <clears throat> it doesn't matter if you were literally delivered in the hospital a couple of days ago in Dubai. <laughs> you will definitely not end up having a citizenship in Dubai. <coughs> Guys, I'm so sorry. I know people who've been born here for 40 years and they would just end, back, end up going back to their parents' country and that's just about it, you know? And talking about the, the system, the, the... Oh, what's that? So talking about the system of gratuity <clears throat> of retirement also that's also a very tricky thing because when you work here for so long you would still just be entitled to everything that you've worked for while you were in Dubai and it's not even it's nothing compared to the social system in Germany 
and so that's like the citizenship the lack of offering citizenship to um to foreigners was a second reason that really um took my mind off dubai and the third reason would be it was just the it was just the extravagance you know there was just the extravagance of the people here is so unnatural and you can feel it you know people are just all about um not just wealth but people were just more all about doing what they can to gain as much and that finding yourself in such kind of place where people are constantly i mean i'm not saying people would want to kill you to make money out of you but i mean there is just this <coughs> I don't know what to call it this greed or this feeling you have that people just want to do anything to make money and of course there are many reasons for that but I felt like Dubai is quite expensive also and people would always want to live you know have a good standard of life and it means if it means doing anything if it means you know um, companies are probably um, in order to cut costs they would you know kick out good employees people who are useful to the company they would maintain the cheapest 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 staff they can get just because they want to cut costs and they don't even mind if these people this people who are taking the least salary are actually doing no work or even contributing but as long as they are able to receive the salary they will just hire them you know and that's the thing <clears throat> and that for me it's not um, it's not something it's not a kind it's not a value I appreciate you know I like quality and <clears throat> and I think that you know when you go to places and you want to have good services um, you need to pay people to be happy to be at the job and to do the job properly anyway <clears throat> that said another reason why I kind of checked out of Dubai oh I think I have my friend visiting me soon and guys just I will go to for breakfast and probably continue from there or I would just continue when I get to the pool okay I see you guys soon <laughs> hello guys so I'm back and with me I have my lovely <laughs> Lilia and she lives here for a couple of years in Dubai hello hi hi, hi. My viewers. hi how are you <laughs> Um, so Lilith would tell us one thing she doesn't like about living in Dubai so would you like to share to my viewers one